Tonight the Mets will try and make it two straight over the Braves. Oh, smoke. It looks oh, fire. The Braves have not lost three games in a row all season. They lost the last game of their series with the Phillies on Wednesday. They lost last night. The Mets are trying to hand them their first three game losing streak. Taiwan Walker, all the numbers that he has have been great all season long, but he loves pitching here at City Field. 3 0 and the ERA 1.93. One down for Dansby. He was 0 for 4 last night. Swing and a shot hammered toward left center field. That's going to get down and bounce off the warning track and wall. And Dansby Swanson glides into second base. In the outfield straight up. The pitch. And it falls out of his hand. Ooh, Walker started no. and stopped. Did he hurt himself? He caught the yep. bottom of his lead spike. And then that kind of maybe jammed it into his head. That was a little scary. Oh, we'll see how he uh, works through this. And the Braves have the game's first scoring chance. See if Matt can make some contact. Boy, a first inning run or two would be nice. Swung on on a fly ball. Ripped down the left field line. Hooking into the corner and off the wall. Dansby will score. Olsen motoring for second base. He's in standing. And the Braves come out guns are blazing. One nothing Atlanta. Taiwan Walker is all over the place here in the first inning. So the Braves have it set up. One in, two on, one out. And Eddie Rosario. Swing, fly ball, well hit right. Marte going back, corner wall, gone! Three run homer, Rosario! And that third base dugout erupts. Four nothing Atlanta. We saw what the early runs did for the Mets last night. Well, Atlanta's come out hot here in the opening inning tonight. Atlanta's had a stretch of nine straight starts, allowing no more than three runs, but that just changed. Ian Anderson, another big start for him. He had perhaps his best start of the season last time out. For the 4 nothing lead, you like your chances. So attack these Mets hitters with the lead. Brandon Nimmo will lead off. Nimmo smacks one to left field. Rosario is playing toward the line. He won't get it. And Nimmo's got an extra base hit to start the Mets first. Dennis. So after the leadoff double, nice work by Ian Anderson. Two quick outs. Two down for Pete Alonso. He drove in three runs last night. Two of them on a home run. A fly ball to deep right. That is hammered. Acuna to the wall. Acuna leaps and Ronald has got it. Whoa! I thought that was way gone. Me too. Ronald robbed him. Wow! What a catch. Everything from the elbow to the end of his glove was above that orange stripe on the top of the right field wall. Ian fired up and so is everyone else and the Mets are blanked in the bottom of the first inning. Night for Harris last night his first night in the Big Apple first game. It hard toward left. Naquin going back checks the warning track. Wall! And that ball is gone. An opposite field homer for Michael Harris. He's got and the Braves take a 5 nothing lead. First home run in the Big Apple. He might have been pointing the fans right. in center field who've been giving him the New York business. If I had to guess, I would say yes. Here in about the last seven minutes, Ronald Acuna has robbed a homer, collected a base hit, and stolen a base. Welcome back. Thrilled to have him back. Mm-hmm. No one out. Five runs on five hits for the Braves. Dansby rests the bat on his right shoulder. Dansby broken bat. Little pop into right field. Marte comes up cleanly. They're going to wave it. Here comes the throw. Instead, no throw. Broken bat hit and an RBI. Ronald scores standing from second, and the Braves continue to pour it on. Six nothing Braves. Here's Austin Riley with runners at first and third, and no one out. Pitch on the way to Riley. Ground ball right side. Taking it, McNeil flips to second for one. Over to first. Too late. A run score. Fielder's choice for Austin Riley, and he rakes in his 69th RBI of the year. Seven nothing Braves. Keep adding on. Just keep pounding it. Oh, one. That's a rocket to left center field. That'll split the gap and go all the way to the wall. How far can Riley go? Around third base. They're going to send him to the plate. The throw is cut off. 8 nothing Atlanta. Austin Riley just scored from first base on a double by Eddie Rosario. Eddie already has four RBIs in the ball game, and the Braves are pounding the Mets 8 to nothing. So the Mets being gifted a chance to get right back into this game. Let's have them load it. The crowd really back into it. It's a window of opportunity. And now Nimmo drove a double to the gap in left center, leading off the first inning. Nimmo gets a fastball and lines it into center field for a base hit. Naquin is in. Here comes Giorme. The throw by Harris to the plate. And Giorme is out. Oh, wow. Down 8 to 1, and the Mets run into an out at the plate. Michael Harris has already shown off his arm in this game, made a perfect throw, and Giorme is thrown out. A huge defensive play by Michael Harris to get out of the jam. Well, the Mets have left six runners on base in the first four innings. They've got two more aboard with two out in the fifth, and another chance for McNeil, who stranded a couple his last time up. 
And he grounds one past Olsen into right field, a base hit. That'll bring in Lindor. Alonzo pulls in at second, and McNeil comes through with a two out RBI to cut the Braves lead to eight to two. Dylan Lee comes into pitch, and Darren Ruff will make his Mets debut as a pinch hitter. And he flies one toward the right field corner. Long run for Acuna back toward the wall. He can't get it. In the score is Alonzo. McNeil hits for the plate. He will score. Darren Ruff with a two run double in his first at bat as a Mets. And now it's eight to four. The instant offense these new players has provided is inspirational. It feels like 2015. Juan Uribe and Kelly Johnson. So Escobar will hit from his better side against the lefty Lee. And this crowd all of a sudden fully <laughs> engaged. And he hits one toward the whole base hit. Ruff around third. He'll come in to score. Back to back pinch hit on. Ruff and then Escobar and now it's eight to five Atlanta. Buck Walter pushing all the right buttons. Mets were down eight to nothing. It's now eight to five. Braves leading eight five. Two men on base, two down. It was going to be left on left. Minter versus Vogelback. Now they're going to pinch it with Mark Canna. Strike him out. Perfect pitch. Inning over. AJ Minter puts out a sixth inning fire. William Contreras, the final hope for the Braves. He's 0 for three with a walk. Contreras drives that ball deep right center on the first pitch. Big home run. Big insurance run. Atlanta adds on with run number nine in the ninth. Well, the Braves book ending this game with power. Homers in the first two innings. Now a homer here in the ninth. Jansen has retired the first two in the ninth. Mets are down to their final out of the night with Jeff McNeil coming up. And McNeil flies one to center field. Back goes Harris to the warning track at the wall. It's out of here. And so Jeff McNeil has hit a sixth home run of the year. The Atlanta lead is now nine to six with the Mets still down to their last out. Aaron Ruff is the hitter for the Mets. Popped up foul territory. Olsen coming over. Believe he's got room. He does. And the Braves went at nine six over the Mets. Both teams landed tons of punches tonight. This was a slugfest. Well, the Braves hold on and win it and even up this series at a game apiece. And the Braves now back to within three and a half games of the first place Mets.